Ian, what you working on there? Cool, you're making a calendar with your photos. Click back a few screens so we can show everyone how easy it is to make stuff with Cube. Oh, but first, a quick tip from Cube. Once you start building a product, you cannot save in process and return later to re-edit. However, you can save the calendar to Cube as a sales listing and in your cart to buy later. Start at the Cube homepage, click on Create at the top of the screen. On the next screen, click on the green banner to create photo products. On the Cube product screen, click on Calendars. This screen provides details about the calendars available and volume pricing. Click on Start Printing. You will see there are two calendar types available. Below that are the calendar options, Start Month, and Holidays. Click on Next to continue. Here on the Photo Select screen, we don't have any images saved to Cube yet. So we'll click on the button for the Cube uploader. Click on Browse and locate the files to upload. Click on the Upload button and close the window when you are done uploading. Calendar tip number one. Select all of the images you may want to use in your project. It's easy to discard extra photos once you get moving down the path in one of the product builders, but it's not as easy to go back and add new images once you're down that road. Back on the photo select screen, here are the images we just uploaded in the image tray. You can click and drag the photos individually down to the selected images tray, or you can use the buttons to the right which is best for our situation since we want to use all of the images we just uploaded. Click on Add All and all 29 photos from the image tray move down to the selected images tray. You can arrange the photos into a specific sequence if you want. Click on Next to continue. That takes us to the image placement screen where we'll lay out our calendar. At the top are the quick build options where you can quickly create your calendar using the auto flow images button and some other things like the number of images per page, a cover title, image spacing, background color, and image cropping. Below the quick build options are the selected images from the previous screen. These photos can be dragged and dropped into the months of the calendar if you are not going to use the auto flow button from the quick build options above. We'll click on the auto flow and apply options button to randomly populate the calendar months quickly with our selected images and the cover title we entered. Now let's go change a few things using the drag and drop technique. On the April page of the calendar, I want just two of the four images to remain on that month. So we'll click on one of the images and drag it off to the right out of the working area to remove it. We'll do the same on a second photo we want to remove from that month as well, leaving just two images on that month. On the cover, we'll click on the Clear Images button to remove all of the images currently on the cover. And grab a different photo from the selected images above to drag and drop as the new cover. Calendar tip number two. If you are planning on selling your calendar in the Cube Marketplace, do not put the year or other dates on the cover. This will allow buyers to select from a range of dates for the calendar, and the listing will never become obsolete. Now the calendar looks how we want, so we'll click on Next to continue. That takes us to the preview screen where we'll confirm the layout and send the calendar to print or we can save it to our Cube store. At the top are the details for the calendar we just made and to the left of that is the cover of our calendar. Below that are the individual months that you can look at more closely by clicking on the magnifying glass in the upper right corner of any month in the calendar. At the top of the screen you can click back to make changes to your calendar or check out to purchase your calendar. To the left of those buttons is the Add to My Cube button that will link you to your store where you can manage your listing for printing, sharing, and selling. Using Cube to make products is quick and easy to do. Try Cube today.